hello students the topic of my today's discussion is the essay from pro section of the syllabus of ba semester 4th of punjab university chandigarh the title of the essay is on shaking hands written by a g gardiner so first of all i would like to discuss the biography of the author born in 1865 ag gardiner was an english journalist editor and author he was one of the most outstanding essayists of the 20th century his essays are full of humor delight and deep thought they amuse us and at the same time compel us to think in his essays he deals with simple and serious matters in an entertaining and delightful manner he treats little things of life in a skillful method some of his popular works are pillars of society windfalls prophets priests and kings and the warlords and some others in the essay ag gardiner takes up the common practice of shaking hands which is so popular with the people of the west this custom has been compared with the customs of other cultures gardiner is very much in favor of this custom as it is very effective and impressive he regards it as the most natural custom of greeting at the same time he points out its disadvantages he gives examples of humorous situations from real life in which shaking hands becomes quite uncomfortable it is an entertaining essay full of wit and humor there are humorous characters descriptions and situations the title gives a peek into the theme shaking hands is a very popular and deep rooted western practice of greeting someone it may be condemned on hygienic grounds but it is very difficult to get rid of it and adopt some more healthy mode of greeting only strict laws and harsh punishment can break this custom the chinese the japanese the indians and the arabs have different modes of greeting and salutation at the time of meeting and parting someone the western mode of shaking hands seems indecent and rude in comparison with other customs the handshake according to the author is the happy mean between the oriental salam and the russian hug it has more warmth and more of the spirit of human comradeship a greeting with the handshake is very warm affectionate intimate and informal a handshake is the indication of a person's health personality and character there are different kinds of handshakes there are soft and gentle hard and painful handshakes but the western ritual of shaking hands is certainly worth the occasional penalty 
a handshake reveals the confidence courage honesty frankness or deceitfulness of a person these are the ways in which hands speak there are warm and loving hands there are listless and flabby hands listless and flabby hand means fat soft and tired hands there are bony energetic hands and there are cold lifeless hands we know hands which we prefer not to shake the western custom of shaking hands may be condemned and criticized on hygienic grounds the hands may be dirty and unclean by shaking hands the germs of diseases can be passed on some more healthy modes of greeting may be adopted namaste or salam of the indian style is by far the best it is greeting a person by folding both of the hands and whispering the greeting from a respectable distance it is the safest and most dignified form of greeting someone so at the end the writer gardiner admires the english custom of shaking hands in spite of its disadvantages he regards it as the happy mean of greeting between the salam or namaste of eastern countries and the hug of russia thank you